And big time, uh, Juan, they are coming in his defense, not only students, but teachers as well and parents as well. Behind me is the scene where it happened, Maywood Academy High School, the scene of that punch that has certainly, well, not heard around the world, but certainly heard around the Southland. As you mentioned, he was arrested, posted his $50,000 bail, got out of jail on Saturday, and now faces charges when he goes back to court November 30th. But as far as support goes, well, it's hands down for this teacher. It was a vicious right to the jaw in music class that sent a 14-year-old student sprawling. The man who delivered the blow, 64-year-old Marston Riley, the music teacher at Maywood Academy High School. I just want to know if he's okay. If he's okay? Yeah. You're concerned about Mr. Riley? Yes. How about the student? Um, the student, I don't really care about him. And nearly all the students we talked to sided with Mr. Riley. All the racial slurs of that kid, that, that kid was just being very disrespectful. To He's me. really calm and he really respects his students and he cares about his students a lot. This is Marston Riley and I'm letting you know that this GoFundMe page is legit. On his GoFundMe page, Riley thanks all those who have contributed to his GoFundMe page. The contributions are getting close to the goal of 50000 I would have done the same thing. Really? Yes. The daughter of this woman had Mr. Riley as a teacher last year. Wow. Us as parents have to learn how to teach our um, kids how to respect teachers and older people. How's you holding up? I don't want to make any comments. Nothing whatsoever? No. I mean, we understand he's got a lot of support. Do we like to, you know, come to the door and just thank the people? A woman in a very soft voice behind a closed door at Riley's Anaheim home said, quote, okay. Mr. Riley has okay. no interest in talking to anyone. Right, thank, thank you. 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 No comment. comment. On the cell phone video, you can hear the 14-year-old calling Riley names, referring to him as, quote, bro, using the N-word and other racial slurs. He throws a basketball at Riley. Seconds later, the punch. This student said she was in the class that day. Do you blame Mr. Riley? No. Not at all? No, not at all. And this statement from the Maywood Academy faculty, quote, many Americans saw for the first time the deterioration of respect for teachers. It goes on. We have created an environment where disrespect, bullying, and intolerance can thrive. We were told Riley has taught at the school for seven years. And from what we learned, he's respected by both teachers and students. Mr. Riley is what the school district calls on home detention. In plain English, that means he's been suspended with pay until further notice. And we don't know how long that will last until further notice is what the district would tell us. Also, in their statement from the faculty, they made it very clear that they are asking the, the, the DA in Los Angeles, Jackie Lacey, not to press any charges against Mr. Riley. Reporting live from Maywood, I'm Dave Lopez, Kick on News. All right, Dave, thank you.